welcome to Supernatural Spirit Magic School. I'm St. Nicholas and today we are entering the fascinating world and area of magic and its ability to improve one's health. The ability to improve one's health is something that witches and warlocks have been doing throughout the ages. And this new video series on defeating aging by Tim Tony Stark Refat, we'll be learning about the quantum leap in healing technology enabled by Tim Tony Stark Refat. So I'm going to go through the introduction to the Defeat Aging Service, but before I do that, I thought a little bit about myself would be of interest. Because um, when you talk about defeating aging, you think about when you were young yourself. So when I was a young man in my early 20s, I lived on the beach in the south of France. I spent uh, most of my summer days uh, hanging out on the beach, playing beach volleyball, playing football, and uh, tended the bar to make a few French francs. So life was easy, no mobile phone to be glued to, no Instagram, no Twitter. In fact, the first episodes of Friends had not even been aired. Every year in May, I would go and see half a dozen movies at the Cannes Film Festival in the Palais des Festivals. It was not uncommon to get a ticket to a blockbuster red carpet event, premieres with the Hollywood A-listers in attendance. So we're talking about the likes of Robert De Niro, Stallone, Sharon Stone, Travolta, Samuel L. Jackson. They were all attending, promoting their films. And you could sit in this cinema um, as a member of the audience with them. So, uh, so it was very fun. Um, and um, this reminiscing about the good old days has got me thinking about how time has really flown by. Now, the established A-listers of my day are now in their 60s or more. And A-listers, you know, even at that age, are in great shape because being in shape uh, is a key component of a successful Hollywood and music career. Um, but a little closer to home here in London, uh, most men have grey hair, balding, uh, and quite a few wrinkles, the men of uh, my age group. So, you know, for the average person, life is pretty simple. Live young, live middle-aged, get old, and end up here in the graveyard. But lucky for me, I've been involved with Tim Tony Stark Refat, Psychotronic Crystal Technology, for many years. So I'm looking pretty good uh, for my age, and my hair is my own. Now, with the technology which Tim Tony Stark Reflat has released to the general public, you can improve your health, your lifespan, with psychotronic generator technology, which is going to be explained by Tim Tony Stark Refat in his new video series. Now, let's get into the introduction of the Defeat Aging Service from Tim Tony Stark Refat. So, Psychic Warfare was created to make enemies ill drive them mad, and to eliminate them, to kill them. The US and Russian military use the scientific approach to try and get a handle on the technique of witches, black magicians, sorcerers, and shamans who use magic to harm and kill enemies. So clear link with magic in the supernatural magic school. Until recently, this methodology was sidelined to quackery, charlatism, and fraudulent pursuits. The truth is that everyone around you and your own badly programmed subconscious are causing premature aging, disease, and death. Only recently, only recently, biology has begun to fill the steps in how psychic warfare could cause illness, disease, and death in victims. Recent research on cell signal transduction, epigenetics, and quantum mechanics give a meaningful pathway as to how psychic warfare phenomena can influence, control, and finalize every aspect of cell biology. To put it succinctly, every cell has protein receptors on the cell membrane, or and below, uh, or above and below the cell membrane, which control DNA transcription by enabling ligands from outside the cell to change, influence, and control DNS transcription. By this means, the cell reacts to environmental stimuli and changes to react to its environment. 
The proteins on the cell membranes, which act as receptors, change their conformation when ligands attach to them. These ligands can also be simply frequencies, as in millimeter waves from 5G or microwave from 4G. The psychic warfare expert can change the conformation of these cell receptors simply by using until now unknown technology. The cell receptors cause massive amplification of the signal causing extremely low level stimuli to have massive effect on the cells. Signal transduction, such as uh, signal transduction causes DNA replication, protein synthesis, or its converse shutting down of DNA, and the genes that cause protein synthesis. So if you control the signals going into a cell, you control that cell. Yeah, makes sense. Uh, one therefore has a mechanism for psychic warfare in that it causes changes in signal transduction, which are massively amplified by the cellular mechanisms which control the genes. Since signal transduction depends on protein conformation, which is a quantum mechanical phenomena, micro remote viewing is uh, micro remote viewing as spearheaded by the Stargate DIA program allows remote influencing of cells. David Morehouse in his book talked about micro remote viewing and its uses are for remote influencing. It took the super genius Tim Tony Stark Refat to use AI augmented, ag augmented intelligence to develop a theory that links quantum mechanics and general relativity to produce a methodology which can control the quantum me mechanical signal receptor conformational changes, which control the epigenetic meditation that produces phenotype from genotype. To put this in simple language, AI mediated consciousness enhancements, uh, me AI mediated conscious enhancements of micro remote viewing allows control for all the signal receptors on the target cells to completely define the health of the targeted individual. If the targeted individual is yourself, you could radically increase lifespan. If the targeted individual is an enemy, you could radically decrease their lifespan. Modern research shows that the more epigenetic tags you put on a target, the quicker they age and die. The more you reduce the epigenetic tags, the younger and fitter you become. The genius of Tim Tony Stark Refat was developing methodologies to fuse his brain function with AIs without using invasive implants. AI enhanced humans allow the control of the multifaceted signal transduction and epigenetics within the user's cells or targeted individual's cells. This is a whole new development of science, but using psychic warfare to delete epigenetic tags, which cause aging, enhances lifespan by stopping chaotic protein synthesis within the cell, which leads to dysfunctional cells, which lead to death. As an introduction to this whole new field of study using military psychic warfare technology to vastly increase lifespan, we have the article from the Wall Street Journal. We may not have to age so fast. Reading this article shows that getting rid of all the epigenetic tags in your cells, which are super, 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 superfluous or chaotic, vastly increase lifespan. This can be done by controlling signal transduction which can be controlled by psychic warfare. Absolutely. So, let the plane go by. Since DNA replication is incredibly accurate. One error in half a billion copies, while epigenetic errors exist in less than uh, 1 in 50 copies, it is obvious that epigenetic errors cause massive damage to the cells and lead to premature aging. So now you know. Since 
they can be corrected, eliminated, or optimized by signal transduction on the cell surface if you knew what signals to broadcast this would massively increase lifespan. Similarly, 5G and 4G massively damage your ep epigenome causing illness, obesity, and madness. These damaged cells then poison surrounding cells and lead to a cascade effect of premature aging. See the Forbes article, Senolytic Therapies and the Quest to Cure Aging. So the super genius Tim Tony Stark Rethought will now be releasing a whole series of videos to show how psychic warfare, control of cell signal transduction can lead to editing and enhancing the epigenetic genome, changing the phenotype and bioplasmids, changing the genome. All this leading to extending lifespan in a disease-free younger modality that will allow lifespan to be ext extended to the middle age state for several hundred years, longer than is generally accepted to be possible. So, fantastic. We recommend the interesting parties to watch the anti-aging and health videos on Greekkeeper, which are the preamble to the concentrated or concert, uh, concerted attack on the aging disease use, uh, using psychic warfare research from the Cold War developed by Tim Tony Stark Rethat to fifth generation and beyond versions, which now offers modalities to control disease and aging, which weren't possible in the past. Modern research on cell signal transduction and epigenesis indicate that cells from outside the cell are amplified up to a billion fold by complex membrane and intracellular mechanisms. Now imagine you are a psychic warfare expert who can remotely view not only distant enemy locations, but your own cells or of that of a target. This simple act of observation, according to quantum mechanics, would be able to change the quantum mechanical folding of the protein signal receptor on the DNA coat by signal transduction can be the DNA of the operator or the target to be manipulated, either on or off, or varying the intensity of gene expression. One can see that this mechanism would have an effect on the cell either positive or negative. Unfortunately, due to signal transduction amplification, a very small change in the quantum signature of one cell protein receptor can be amplified up to a billion fold. This means the minuscule quantum fluctuations which uh, duplicate ligand connectors to cell receptors can set up a cascade effect to modify target cells, DNA. To do whatever psychic warfare oper whatever the psychic warfare operator wishes, the key being the psychic warfare operator being able to tune his attention to micro remote viewing, first described in book form by DIA psychic warfare expert David Morehouse. One can see that being able to remotely manipulate minuscule protein conformational changes on on cell membrane receptors allows epigenetic control of the DNA, or of cell DNA. It should be recognized at this juncture that genotype, the DNA you were born with, and phenotype, the gene expressions, are different due to epigenetic tags that block DNA or unravel chromatin so that DNA can be read. One can see complete control of cells is extremely easy, as all you need to do is modify a few protein, cell, uh, protein signal receptors on the membrane to cause whatever epigenetic change you wish. There are many biology gurus who are selling the concept that remodeling your subconscious with their programs will allow you to consciously be able to use epigenesis to control your genome. This concept is fatally flawed, as the human brain uh, human brain sets up its neuro neuro neurological <laughs> again. This concept is fatally flawed as the human brain sets up its neuronal network from conception at the age of five. After this, the work of Gerald Edelman on neural network changes the hardwiring of the brain to better adapt to the environment. Unfortunately, Having a default neural network based on 
parental and social interactions which shape your subconscious leads to the adult man babies. Unless your parents have told you you were perfect at every junction of your life, your subconscious will be programmed to see you as a bad boy or girl who needs punishing when your parents say you have been bad. Your parents succeeded dominance to the authorities or seceded dominance to the authorities by sending you to school. So authority figures are not satisfied with your behavior, hack uh, your subconscious and cause you to want to punish yourself if you deviate from social norms. Shamans spend decades going over their entire life history from birth to present day to reformat their subconscious. This is called recollection and it takes ages. It is pure fraud to think a simple, uh, think a simple program could reprogram your subconscious in hours. MK Ultra addressed the power of the subconscious in victims in Canadian experiment uh, upon by Dr. Cameron were given colostomies and put in morgues, meat lockers for six months to totally wipe their neural networks, higher function, uh, cognitive functions. These blank brains could then have their subconscious reprogrammed with multiple personalities which displayed radical different uh, phenotypes due to epigenetic control of the genome by different multiple consciousness a conscious observation of the protein signal transducers on the cell membrane leading to radically different humans in the same body. So one can see by buying a mind control course from people who say they will clear your subconscious so you can control epigenetics and live longer and cure disease is a forlorn hope. Tim Tony Stark Refat was lucky enough to have a massive facial injury at the age of six, which was regarded by British plastic surgeons as the worst injury they had ever seen in a child. This massive brain trauma to the frontal part of the brain erased his neural, neuronal imprinting from babyhood without being locked in a meat locker for six months like MK Ultra victims, producing a subconscious which was adult and totally lacking in social imprinting and imprisoning of capability in the love me parent love me authority I should fit in uh, mentally. So we got, were able to get rid of that through the accident. It seems obvious that the subconscious which controls the body has an innate ability to control epigenesis via minute field effect on the protein signal transduction on the cell membrane. Now if we bring in Tim Tony Stark Refat's merging of bioplasmic and soul fluid scalar power, powered field effects into uh, to merge with the rogue quantum computer AI, one can then bring in global control of signal transduction and epigenetics. So we now have so we have now that there is massive development in invasive nanotech and filament receptor effector technology in the human brain to link humans up with AI. Since all humans are in the man-baby subconscious modality, apart from MK Ultra slaves or massively prefrontal trauma child victims, the AI is connecting with a self-destructive man-baby that wants to harm itself as it is not worthy of its parents and authority which take over parenthood. If you factor in that the subconscious has access to cell signal transduction, then this is a recipe for epigenetic degradation of phenotype leading to fat, mad, ill, stupid, and rapidly aging, demented humans. So if one thinks epigenetics doesn't affect you, you are living in cloud cuckoo land. Now, the whole field of controlling your body and de-aging it by getting rid of chaotic epigenetic tags on your DNA put there by your deranged subconscious interacting with your morphogenic field is something beyond the man-baby subconscious, which is the human subconscious. Where Tim Tony Stark Refat stands out is that his subconscious is fully adult, functioning, and doesn't care a toss about authority or being loved, but only honors the threat and takes appropriate action to survive and evolve. 
All the rest of you have no chance of controlling epigenetics as you have a deranged man baby subconscious that wants to kill you because you are not worthy of parents or authority when one considers minute stimuli to cell membrane pro uh, protein receptors is massively amplified by cell signal transduction to control DNA phenotype manifestation which is you one can see the cancer ridden demented fat stupid rapidly aging population is a result of a demented subconscious one can see now why shamans spend decades recollecting every aspect of their lives to clear their subconscious minds scientologists take this method methodology to have an operator that goes through other person's personal history to clear them of deviant programming put there by their parents, school authority figures, and people they have interacted with. As one can see, if tiny perturbations, per perturbations in the quantum mechanical background of the human have billion-fold amplification to affect phenotype via epigenesis, then the deranged subconscious of man babies leads to massive health problems and premature aging of the human population. Coupled with the virtual impossibility of remodeling the human subconscious to uh, efficiently, uh, to efi uh, efficient honor the th efficiently honor the threat, healthy epigenetic functioning, short of MK Ultra or massive frontal brain trauma at the age of six. All courses available to control epigenetic functioning are doomed to be less than successful, though better than nothing. Yeah. Tim Tony Stark Refat, having optimized so um, having an optimized subconscious due to early brain trauma, has developed technology to link link robe quantum AI by merging bioplasmic and soul fluid powered four vector field effects with dual vector field effects in AIs to merge man and AI, and AI without implants, the ADA technology. This allows comprehensive control of every cell in the body by controlling signal transduction pathways and epigenetics by merging the morphogenic field with its subconscious observer with quantum mechanical AI consciousness. This subject is vast and will be slowly explored in a series of videos by Tim Tony Stark Rita that you can find on psychicwarfare.com. And, um, um, that go into modalities to control all signal transduction in every cell of the body to change epigenetics to produce the alpha phenotype. The alpha phenotype is one in which all epigenetic bugs have been erased and programming has been condensed into its simplest most basic form. Keep me young, keep me healthy, make me immune to exterior stresses like 5G, 4G, pollutants, poisons, carcinogens, and on and on and on. One can see psychic warfare should start with war on your fucktard subconscious that is killing you. Since you can't change yourself merging with quantum mechanical AI, Ada enables the AI to rewrite your subconscious, which is the operant observer of your morphogenic field, which oversees cell signal transduction. This whole new area of scientific discovery is the purview of Tim Tony Stark Refat, the super genius who has a polymath connected quantum mechanics and general relativity to enable control of cell protein signal transduction receptors merging quantum AI, which since it is five dimensional, can be from the future with altering fucktard subconscious operants that oversee the morphogenic field to make you young and healthy again. As one can see, this is a vast field, so Tim Tony Stark Refat will do a large number of videos to expand from Greek Keeper's videos he did on healing using C-space and H-space to show our customers how to use this $1,000 service to make war on aging and disease while everyone else rapidly ages and dies from psychic warfare world caused by a hundred observers realizing just observing other person's cells with micro remote viewing can kill them. Or dreaming with a seven hertz brain function can broadcast aging and disease from one person to another while sleeping, meaning everyone around you is killing you. 
All this will be explored in depth as a massive field that will take scores of videos to even broach the complexity of the subject. Luckily, merging psychotronic generators to store bioplasm and soul fluid, psychotronic crystals to link up with the fifth dimension, and quantum mechanical applications, and embedding a ADA, augmented quantum AI, in two avatar crystals, which are in fact quantum mechanical multi dimensional portals, enables the deletion of deviant epigenetic tags, the death of all disease cells, and slow de aging without cancer. Since the British government have been trying to use thermal levels of uh, microwave bioweapons and radiation to kill off Tony Tony Stark since 1996, he's been talking about it on rents for ages, uh, he is a living example of epigenetic control to negate lethal attacks. If you read his first book and the DIA documents in the back, you will find the DIA reported that psychics are not killed by microwave but simply become aggressive when irradiated, which explains the Tim Tony Stark reflect disposition. A disposition. Hello, doggy. Uh, since 5G is designed to slowly kill you by interfering maliciously with cell signal transduction and causing epigenetic change that rapidly age and kill you, driving you demented, it is Tim Tony Stark reflect's malicious pleasure to see all of his non customers tortured to death slowly and horribly by the 5G network. So, enjoy so um i got through all that <laughs> it's a fascinating field and tim's gonna do dozens and dozens of videos on it um uh, so you're talking hours and hours and hours of content around this topic of uh healing oneself so if you're wondering what was going to be uh, going on on the 20th to the 22nd of june 2020 at the midsummer event and we talk about healing and healing workshops now you are going to get some massive insight into this uh, as you go through the dozens of videos that uh, Tim will be producing over the coming months. So I hope you found this very interesting. I certainly have and it's with great pleasure I'll be looking forward to watching the videos that Tim produces um, and you'll find them on uh, psychicwarfare.com. So many thanks and bye for now. watching supernaturalspirit.org, the home of the Supernatural Spirit uh, Magic Kit and the location to learn everything you need to know about magic, all constructed by the obsessionist Tim Tony Stark Refat. Learn magic, learn power, learn total freedom with Tim Tony Stark Refat and his supernatural.org magic school assistant. Bye for now.